No Jumper, coolest podcast in the world. We are here to interview our little homie, Suey, but look who you brought with him. Little Skies, Landing Cube, the whole gang is here. Are all the microphones on? They look on. Yeah. 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 We're lit. Check. Yeah. We here. How you guys doing? We lit, man. We chill it out here. my little bro, Suey Deshaun, you dig? We all got our diamond teeth in, besides Landing. though, before we start the interview, you feel me? The dude, no, nah, the teeth are very, very important, you know? Well, actually, I never wear them normally, but, you know, they seem important. Yeah. Okay. So, Suey, so we got we to gotta do the introduction to you just to start things off. Tell us a little bit about yourself. Like, like, uh, where do I start? Um, let's start with, okay, so I know your dad. Big yeah. bearded Mexican motherfucker over here. <laughs> um, wh- where are you from? Let's start there. I'm from... The Bay Area, but I was born in Riverside. Not a lot of people know that. But, really? Yeah, but I grew up in the Bay, so like, yeah, it's pretty much where I'm from. Okay. And so, uh, what kind of upbringing did you have? Even though you're, fi- what are you, 15? 14. 14. So you're yeah. still very much in the middle of your upbringing as we yeah. speak now. Yeah. What do you mean upbringing? Like, like I don't know. Tell us a little bit about uh, what you were like as a as a young kid. As a jit. <laughs> you know what I mean? As a jit, you dig? Cause he still is a jit. You are still yeah. a jit, okay? Yeah, I mean, um, I mean, I was just doing basic ass shit. I mean, sport, school, all that shit. Cause like, all my life it was growing up, it was like I had to do something. Like they, my parents didn't care what it was, but I had to do something with my life. Like I couldn't just go to school and just play fucking Xbox. Why? Cause you just had too much energy. Nah, I I was just chilling, but, like, I had to do something with my life, like, for, like, a career. But, like, now I'm doing this rapping shit. Like, they're cool with me just going with this. You're 14. So uh, most people don't <laughs> have, like, what they're going to do career-wise figured out at 14. So it's good that you were, like, that motivated to sort of figure it out that early on. Yeah, bro. It's crazy, bro, the way it all happened, bro. You're, for, like, one of the first dudes who, like, we found your video when it was on stream. It barely had any views. And then I feel like you're in a very different position now. You had like not a lot of followers. Yeah, hell yeah. Pull up. That's crazy, bro. How the, Shout out to what no what? Jumper, man. Shout out to no jumper and Adam, man. We be finding the kids young. Definitely. Yeah, start them young. You gotta start them young. <laughs> gotta start them young. Okay, but how did you end up writing a song like that? Pulling did you really pull up with the Molly? Did you really have perks? Tell us about this. I mean, <laughs> so a lot of people like to ask me this. Um, if you know me, you know what I be doing. You know if I pull up with the volley or the perks. But if you don't know me, you don't really need to know. You know, know what I'm saying? I really hope that you are not actually familiar with Molly and Percocets. <laughs> I'm just going to throw that out there. He's not, but. Were you selling it? Are you a young, like, Pablo Escobar? Yeah, That's type, cool. type, you know. That's probably more brand safe to say, like, yeah, you know, I was selling it, not doing it, if you want to bullshit. Yeah, what? Don't say that either. So when you when you look at that song though, was it just like you just wanted to make a banging rap song and you just decided to talk some shit about drugs or like what was the mentality? Yeah, type. But I I just wanted to make like a banging rap song and nobody nowadays they don't want to hear you talking about like. Your life and the struggle. They want to hear some like, some like new wave type of shit. Like just like on some other shit. Mm. Like if I was like out here rapping like some lyrical shit, it would be a lot harder for me to come up. Mm. So you kind of went in the direction of the stuff that you were a fan of anyway, or what? Yeah. What kind of artists like motivated you to start making music? Um, this kind of music is like, type like Migos, like. Um, Young Thug, Young Thug is fire. Very um, important. Yeah. Future, a lot of rappers like that, bro. Just seeing them, too, like, before, like, I even made my song, I just seen them. How did you and, meet Little Skies and Landon? Um, it was... How did we? Yeah. I, I swear I was just, like, one day chilling, and Nick was like, yo... That kid, Sue Generous, pull up with the Molly kid. Is not a, <laughs> oh, <laughs> pull up with the Molly he kid. Like, you want to meet him? He was he just came my. Oh yeah, day. Nick. I, Nick, I was chilling. My, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah, shout out to okay. Jandor Media. He definitely showed me Suey. and I was like, yeah. oh That's shit. That's a plug, right there. I was bro. like, oh shit, he's fired. I already knew who he People was. People don't though, know though. People don't know like, though. Suey's like this in real life though. Like, yeah, bro. You I'm feel just, me? That's all that matters. Like, fuck what everybody's saying, cause 
This kid real life like is next. No bullshit. When I heard Lil Skies really say that, you feel me? No bullshit. That's a big cosign. Like, when I first heard pull up, shit. I thought it was cool and stuff. But then when I met you in real life, I was like, oh shit, this kid could definitely go somewhere just because you have like a like a really good personality for like a young kid, and that just that that goes Thank a long you, way. I feel like you know. Appreciate that. So so how do you how do oh, you meet yeah. Skies? So, Tell us like, from your perspective. Um, I he texted me Genora Media. He he shout out him. He texted me and he told me like, yo, I be shooting like Lil Sky videos, like we we gotta get some shit in. And then like I was like, yeah, bro, we have to, cause I I found him off of this video. It was on I think Elevator. It's called Rude. Mm. Yeah, but I seen that and then that's how I knew who he was. And I think Jandora shot that one, so like I got familiar with both of them. And then I seen he texted me, so I was just like, oh dope. And I just started talking to him, listening to more of his music. And then what was I? I was in, we just, he posted a video, and he, like, mentioned me in his story. It was, like, him, he was, like, singing Pull Up in the car. Oh. He was just jamming out to it, and then I hit him back, and we were just, like, talking. And then, um, what happened? Hold up. Yeah, we were just talking. And yeah, then, it was weird, too. Yeah. I remember. I thought, no, nah, it wasn't weird, but I was just, like, damn, like, it's this little kid, and then his dad is probably running his career, and he can't, like... <laughs> Yo, Dude, but it was yeah. really him, Yo, bro. So he said that. He it was said really that him talking to me. His dad's just kind of along for the bro, ride. Bro, it was really him <laughs> talking to me. Like, bro, he's in the back. Bro, bro. it's really him talking to me. That's why I fuck with Suey. Like, I don't even hang out with people like that. I, I stay around the same people, but that's like, you feel me? He's got that personality, like mm. that older type shit. That, he just, told me that. In... I was like me, you feel me? I was the young kid that yep. was like hanging out with the older people all the time. So I know what the shit like. Yeah, he told me that in New York. Like, is this you? <laughs> like, I was like, bro, this is me. Like, dead ass. I, like, I was like, yo. FaceTime me, and then like that was like he FaceTime me, and I was making an album in New York. I was making it like all on Cito on the beats, uh, beat shout out him. But like I had this song, and he was like, bro, send me something. I was like, bro, I was literally about to tell you that like like that I was gonna send you some or just back and forth, you know, like we need to work on the track. And then I just went in the studio, found the best one I had, sent it his way. Oh, so that's how your first collaboration came about. Hell yeah, we just did this shit off the rip. He sent me in, and I did it, like, quick. That's fine. Just did it, hell yeah. I was it was lit. too lit. Didn't you I had record to. your verse in, like, a fucking, like, a hotel with Sprite? Yeah, hell yeah, hotel room, you dig? <laughs> we still on that shit, too, by the way. Yeah. Hell yeah, we still on that shit. No that was lit. <laughs> and then I met him in his Airbnb. I, I pulled up with him, or Jandora, and then we just pulled up on landing, and he was just there. And then he had a favorite food. Shout out Tommy's. <laughs> the burger spot? That was nasty as fuck. Bro, he always says that. Look, Landon will always say that Tommy's is disgusting, but like, bro, you ate that whole fucking burger. Because I didn't want your dad to like get mad that I didn't like that. Get mad at him and be like, yo, you gotta eat that hey, shit. Bro, I'm it. Eat that but you're out. talking about Tommy's, the burger spot? Yeah. That's funny. That shit, bro. That's funny. That shit good. You know, one time I went there and some guy tried to get me to join his like Nazi gang. Like, like never, no, straight up. The key to never go there again. Like, okay. This dude straight up started telling me about his like crew and how I should join his crew, and then he told me his name and told me to Google him, and I like found out he was on some like crazy Nazi shit, and I was like, wow, that like just happened. Like so you he had was, a famous Nazi trying to recruit you. I, I mean, not that he was famous, but he was like in like the newspaper like 20 years ago for killing some black kids or some shit, and then he got out oh. and is at the burger spot trying to recruit people. Don't go to Tommy. I'm like, no, why no, is this guy no. talking to me? And then I figured no, it out. Hey. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. I mean, I'm sure Tommy's was not directly involved in this guy and his Nazi gang thing, but anyway. Yeah, they got some weird locations that, that yeah, yeah. Together, yeah. Well, they put the big beans on everything, you know? Oh yeah, bro. You gotta get the, the fucking chili the That's chili burgers like and shit. It, bro. I'm Mexican, bro. I love my beans. Oh you are Mexican. <laughs> Do you end bomb in your songs? Nah. No, okay. Brand safe? Uh, yeah, just chilling, bro. Gotta Not keep yet. that that Gatorade. Yeah, one day. <laughs> one day. <laughs> one day that Gatorade will turn darker and you'll start dropping the N word. That's scary shit to That's imagine. Anyway, um, Okay, so what, let's talk about your dad and your relationship with him. Do you like? Do you feel like he's sort of little taying you or no? Nah, fuck that, bro. <laughs> yeah, that, yo, yo, he's wild with the bro. Uh, everybody thinks like that. Somebody's behind me. Somebody's running shit. But like, it's I, actually Skies. It's not your dad. <laughs> Skies is writing everything. It is Skies. No, but it's just 
Bro, it's just me, bro. Like, I write my own shit. I do everything myself, bro. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so he, he pretty much, like, does what he wants. And then, of course, you just got your people. Like, it's better to have your family yeah. to put your shit in play. Yeah. Really? Put yeah, it in play. Like, how you want it to go, you feel me? Who else would you trust? I, I need my parents, bro, because I'm a minor. I can't he got good much. parents, bro. We actually like his dad. Yeah, it's definitely cool. They cool as fuck. Shout out to Stewie's pops and moms, you dick. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so he's not Lil Tan, you. I'm glad we got that out oh, of the way. Yeah, definitely not that. That's uh-huh. scary. Do you think that if your dad had like had like been cool with you doing the stuff you're doing now and you were nine, that it would be kind of fucked up and that 14 is a whole different story? Honestly, I don't know. But for my situation, bro, I'm just doing what I want, mm. bro. And it's like it's not, it's nothing bad, bro. Yeah. Bro. Is it a lot of pressure, like having more Gucci and more drip than like anybody else your age that you know? It's like, you know, it's something, it's something <laughs> soft, bro, you know? You, know, Yo, you got to move the Gatorade so they can see the Donald Duck chain. Oh yeah. Screenshot and zoom in on that if you're if you're watching at home. Yeah. Hey, shout out to Bay Jeweler, G Star Jewelers, best jeweler in San Jose, best jeweler everywhere. Also, before Thanks, I get going man. here, I got to give some of this Bear Woods Diablo OG to Skies and Landon, Dang, not not to Suey because he's not of age. Dang. No, don't yeah, Suey me. doesn't smoke or nothing. But shout out way. to Bear Woods because they're keeping us rolling. Damn. That's that good shit, right? That's good shit. <laughs> hey, even rappers like it. That says a lot about the Bear Woods quality. They already got blunts in hand, and they're still impressed. Let me get a whiff. You ever smell weed smell before? Bear it's crazy. You, <laughs> Bear Woods, oh, yeah. yeah, they do. <laughs> you ever smell it? Yeah. You ever smell it? Smell it I'm not going to let you smell Oh, yeah, yeah. How is it? What do you think of the smell? It smells kind of like a... Uh, garbage. Stunk. Like bad kids? Nah, it smells like candy. Wait, okay. When you, so, got, when you got the good weed, it's not like candy. Why'd you get the Donald Duck chain? Bro, so he's like, bro, I can make you your own personal piece if you want, but that's going to take you like two weeks to get mm-hmm. your piece. And I'm like, nah, I want that one on the wall. <laughs> and then he's like, why do you want that one, bro? I can make you a piece. I'm like, bro, but that one is just made already. Right. Hey, but it wasn't no mall shit. No you middle of the mall. Yeah, it wasn't none bro. of that. It's actually real. You feel me? Real like shit. real shit. Real and shit. And real jewelry. You feel me? Yeah. Oh, yeah, sir. It was just there. That's why I grabbed it. Right. And it was made, so I was like, "Fuck, give me that." Oh yeah, I forgot about my drip that question. That's hard. That might as well be like. That should, that could be a logo. Or something. You don't got your chains on today, huh? Bitch, chilling. Screw. No, I don't got my chain on. It's a low key, low no, skies just day. Chilling, you know? Yeah. Just collecting the M's. Has it been insane for you, like being friends with these guys? Seeing Landon and Skies blow the fuck up over the past year, I guess, is actually way less than a year. Has it been crazy? Has it motivated you? Yeah, it's crazy, bro. Like, everybody around me is blowing up. All the homies are blowing up. All the brands, all the camera, everybody around me is blowing up, bro. It's crazy. Mm. It's a, yeah, it's motivational as fuck. Like, seeing them going crazy. Yeah. But, it's too, just, one thing, it's, like, weird having us, like, as friends. We all around each other all the time. Yeah, so we really like, think about yeah. it because we really, like, chill, right. chill all the yeah, time. Yeah, so it's, like, we have no choice but to do shit. Mm. We have no choice but to keep going. Yeah. It's weird. Even when you want to be down, you can't because, like, you got niggas, everybody around you is doing shit. All of us <coughs> is, like, everybody's eating. Everybody's winning. That's all we want. We want the world to win. Right. People yeah. just be, like, on some other shit. We just be, like, fuck it. Yeah. I remember yeah. there was a moment, like, because, you know, I, I, I seen that old photo when we first all met at APG. And there was right. definitely a moment, like, maybe, like, six months ago where I was, like, holy fuck. Like, this shit is definitely, like... Skies and Landon just officially went from the category of like dudes I knew who were coming up a little bit that were talented to like oh shit like I think in particular it was when I started seeing the videos of you guys playing live and seeing the crowd lose their mind and all of a sudden World Stars reposting and shit then I'm like oh okay the World Star too man they just be showing us hella love off the love this is no joke like this is really really going crazy (coughs) for real bro bro. they go crazy we all go crazy on the stage bro for Mm. real. I don't even know what happened, bro. I'm I literally sure, don't. Just like, like, it just happened, bro. And it's like, damn, we just still doing what we've been doing. Nothing's really changed at that's all. Just like, so wild, yeah, crazy, that's the bro. wild thing. Like, still living normal, still being like doing whatever we're doing. It's like lit. We keep, and it's dope having Suey around. Like, we fuck with Suey, like yeah. hard. Yeah. We just don't. This ain't just no like do a song and like, yo, like da da da. Nah, like we actually fuck with each other, be around I each other. I didn't do a song with him until like. Months bro. after we, yeah, you know, that was like, weird, bro. Because wow, it it was hard. Like, it was easier to make a song with him because it was like we're kind of like around the same style. But like, to make a song with him, it was like hard. So like, I had to wait and like develop as an artist before I could like, like adapt to what he's doing because it's like 
Like I had, I just had to adapt to it. We got a song though. It's crazy. Right. That shit gonna drop. Do you feel like you're still like developing and like changing as an artist a lot? And you're so young in particular. I guess obviously you are, but do you, you feel like you're rapidly like developing your craft? Yeah, I think like every song I'm, I'm like getting better, and I'm just like, I'm really trying to do like a lot of different styles of music, like right. not just like one. I'm trying to do everything. You gonna like do the XXX and Tassian thing and put out like a campfire album? Now, so we got yeah, shit like that, bro, that and it's so fire. Like, that's the thing people don't know. Like, it's like, like I said, remember I said when he reminded me of like me, like literally, bro. He create, he wanna just try shit. He wanna do shit. Right. That's lit. That's how I am. I just wanna do shit. I wanna make. I just wanna do whatever the fuck I wanna do. That's how he is, bro. Literally, just bro, make whatever we, the fuck he wanna make. We all got some crazy shit in the vault for real. I got some like. Some song gonna make you cry, bro. For real. Really? Yeah. Me? Yeah. yeah. You. Wow. I don't know about these guys, but you. Really? Yeah. <laughs> They'll just get right yeah. to me. Yeah. It's like a diss track about me. I'm gonna listen to it and just be bummed out. Right. Like, Damn, yeah. I thought he was hey, cool, man. Yeah, it's all about you, bro. <laughs> That's what it is, bro. That's crazy. No, I, I see that in you guys though, because I know, like, I mean, when you fir- when you guys first started blowing up, it's like a lot of people kind of like stop being around each other when they start blowing up, and like you and Landon are still like on tour together all the time. Has that been an important thing, like in terms of like obviously you probably have promoters trying to book you separately and stuff, but are you guys like nah, like we're trying to do the same nah, tours? Fuck no, me and my niggas ride together till I'm in the grave, bro. That's facts. I like mean, we literally, do, we everybody. Do do our own shit, but like we are always like. Everything's friends, like, together, though. Not, like, Everything's together in the end like of the day, though. It is. Like, literally. My tour, Sui was there. Landon was there. Sprite yeah. was there. Nick was there. Everybody was there that I've been doing this shit with. It's always going to be that. Dazed and Blaze, Wiz Khalifa, it's the same shit. Nothing changed. Oh, yeah. Literally, bro. Just the same shit. Like, why not? We just trying to, like... See, we trying to show people, brother, we just love this shit. Nothing's changed. Like, literally, bro. We just love what we do. Like, we really love making music. We love going out in front of a crowd, having fun. Oh, yeah. We really just having fun with this shit. Having fun, real. bro. Yeah. No, because you, you were with, you were, uh, the time when I seen you perform live recently, you opened up for him. Yeah, I, I was on tour with them, too, bro. My whole Tatsui opened up hell of my shows, bro, on the tour. Yeah, bro. Like, that shit was silly. lit. What's First that experience one. like, though? Are, do you feel excluded from being able to do all the shit that they do because they're older ever? Nah. No? Pretty much get to nah, be along? Like, yeah, it's like, I feel like we're all like the same, even though I'm a lot younger. Well, not really. These guys are young as fuck, for real. What are you guys, like 19 or some shit? I'm 19. I'm so. 20. Yeah, I'm 19. Old head. Old yeah, head he's laying like over here. Head. He's, like, <laughs> he's, like, he's, like, he's like 40 years old. He's like 12 years old. Well, I'm 34. And people talk about me like I'm about to get fucking Social Security next Damn, week. So, that's yeah. crazy. <laughs> 34. I know. Oh, imagine. Yo, you're lit, bro. Damn, like, nah. You're the bro. youth. We're the yeah, youth, bro. bro. Yes, yes, we you are. Pass, like, 31. 17. <laughs> 17. I got a fake idea. This is I'm 17. Bro, you can pass like yes. 14, bro. I could just be like a 17 year old that's seen a lot of shit. 6 3. Yeah. Uh, there's so many giveaways that I'm an old fuck. It's all good though. Uh, I love how he just beats us all up. Yeah, you, know, you got to because it's like they're going to do it for me. So I got to sort of get in there and make fun of myself before. Like, well, the, to, like the Eminem shit. Today's Father's Day. That's funny. Oh, I forgot today is Father's Day. Are you a father? No. Well, yes. Well, to a lot of little SoundCloud cool. motherfuckers. But not, hey, not oh, from shit, my own bro. semen. No. Bro, shit. Nah, bro, bro hey, shit. Though. Happy, father's day. Day. happy Father's Day. Happy Father's Day. I appreciate that. Day. My guys. Bro, shit. Yeah. Oh, shit. Hey, I actually oh, got shit. you a little gift. Yo, Shut can you give up. me my bag? <gasps> oh no. You're giving me an MCM bag? It's, ringing, it's lit. Yeah, it's, What's in here? And it's not a dildo. Yeah. Oh god, that would be really, really awkward. Yeah. Right on the line. Uh oh. Let me look in here. Yeah, YouTube's see. actually really not into sex toys, so that that's a good thing. If it's not a dildo. <laughs> I've had to blur out a dildo in a video out. before. Yo, my bag is so fucking little. Yeah, you got a lot of shit in there? Yeah, I got a bunch of shit in here. Up. It's lit. We got the racks. These right here, bro, are the. Yo, it's. I'm actually excited. Lot. I have no These idea what's gonna come out. Oh, from, yeah. from <gasps> the exact cloud level, Oh my God, these are going in the SoundCloud Hall of Fame, bro. Oh yeah. Whoa. Yeah, those is the those is the cloud goggles. Dude, I just entered the clout fucking third dimension, man. Yeah, bro. I think I just hit a million on the gram. Aren't you out of plan? I got 280k as soon as I put this on. No, I'm at wow. 730. <laughs> 730. 
Seven thirty. Damn, those 730. are hard. <laughs> <laughs> those, are, those are Sui editions. Exclusively. Snapchat. Bro, exclusively. Are they smaller? Yeah, they are. I think they, they are. Yeah, they fit my head real tiny. Uh, but I'm kind of into that. They look fire. That's I'm super sick. into this. Damn, bro. I need more <laughs> gifts. This is like the opposite of Nardwar. Like, you're giving me gifts. That's cool. Right. We pull up with the gifts, man. Do either of you guys get Nardwar interviews yet? Oh, it's coming. Oh, it's coming? I can't say, oh, it's coming. It's coming. It's coming. Yeah, it's on the board, Nardwar, man. He's been doing all the that, homies dude. lately. I love that, dude. I don't even fuck with interviews, bro. I fuck with the No Jumper and the Nardwar. Hey. Way. No, because no Nardwar just did Pump, uh, Juice World, yeah. and Slump God. Hell yeah. Shout out to all them. Getting all, all the homies fire. in there. Yeah, bro. Fire. Hell yeah. He's lit. Juice World. Juice World's been exploding. I'm very proud of him. I love Juice World, bro. Shout out to Juice World. No bullshit. We fuck with Juice World hard. Watching what's happened to him over the past couple months is honestly he like. number one on Billboard. That's so fire. So Congrats crazy. Congrats, bro. Congrats. But, but you know what? I was looking at five. shit. He got two songs with like 20 million players. I'm like, yo, that's exactly where Skies was at like six months ago or it some was. shit. It's crazy. And now bro. those songs have like hundreds of millions. It definitely, but he's already on his way. He's already in the hundreds. Shout out to bro. I'm proud he's of turning him. Turning up, proud. I'm proud too. Like it man. is. It's just crazy because I just ex- honestly, it's kind of like a deja vu thing because I was just watching this Juice World video on Instagram on World Star actually, and it's like the same way with like your shit started blowing up where it's like they know all the fucking words. I'm like, holy fuck, Juice World is blowing the Selling fuck out. up right Pretty in front sure. of our eyes. Bro, his album was crazy, too. Man, shout out to Cole Bennett, too, man. We want to make big a part big of that shout come out up. to Cole Bennett, bro. Very, very shout out to Cole facts. Bennett. Shout out to bro, bro. Real shit, man. That's a real ass nigga, bro. I'm oh, still... shout out to Neek. He's not here today. Shout out to Neek, bro. I love real Neek. shit. I'm Nick still so blown away by all it. of our music, man. Oh, really? Okay. Shout out to yeah, Nick. he yes, makes sir. Sir. Fuck Fuck All of our shit. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. Yo. <laughs> beef. We got beef. Is Nick okay. watching this? I Dude, when I did oh, the Cole Bennett man. podcast, like, he was still at the level where he was kind of like just a guy doing videos and shit, but it's like now, it's like Lyrical Lemonade is on a different fucking level, like the level that he's at now where... If getting an interview with him, or, or excuse me, a video with him is like one of the biggest things that could right. possibly happen to bro, you as a right. rapper. All right. That's that crazy. crazy. Right, bro. Kevin and it's Gates. Like, bro, we was talking about it like Cole, like, bro, it's just crazy how his like career and everything like took off, bro. Mm-hmm. Like, it's so lit, bro. And how he's like really changing hip hop. Like, this shit's for the youth, bro. Like, he really is like doing something. Like, Lyrical Lemonade is like a. It's gonna become like a well-known name. I feel like a hip hop. Like it's is. something that's like the face, right? It's gonna be like the face of this shit, bro. I'm telling oh, you, yeah. like the youth, like for real. And is there's so many plan. ways that he could have made it so that his cosign was not as powerful? Like if mm-hmm. he was just doing videos yeah. with whoever, putting out a ton of videos. Bro, but he was genuinely yeah. fucking with who he mm-hmm. fuck with, bro. Like no yeah. fuck shit, like. Cole, Jen, like, he fuck with me, bro. Like, really, really when I talked to him first time on FaceTime, like, it was no bullshit. Like, he showed me that he was interested. That shit made me want to go even harder because you showed me that you care. Right. You feel me? He's like that with everybody. I tell you, like, everybody works with him will tell you that same shit. Yeah. Real shit about him. Like, his shit, shit has that power now where it's like power. he's so obviously turning down, like, almost everybody that's trying to fuck mm-hmm. with him that the power of the cosine is just, like, right. mega sized right. at this point. Mm-hmm. Yeah, bro. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Cole crazy and it's not that he's like blocking people out or anything like trying not to not fuck with them it's just like he's working with now he's at the point in his career where he can genuinely fuck with who he wants to fuck (laughs) with like and take his time you feel me so you can't be hating on that you feel me it's just like people don't understand how this shit goes bro like they don't understand you can't just go ahead and do something just because like oh because i feel bad it's not like that anymore bro like no sympathy clout (laughs) no bullshit though no sympathy clout at all what are you guys talking about Post Malone oh. video he did. Oh really? Just how that's, that's fire that. as fuck. It's not yeah. out yet. No, nah, nah, holy nah. shit, uh, yeah, it's good nah. shit. It's yeah. the Post Malone. One Sway Lee. Whoa, one. that's huge. Yo, that's gonna Cole, change everything. Yeah, Cole's on his shit, bro. Oh my Cole's god, shit. that's ridiculous. Yeah. Gucci wears all that. He just Gucci. Did Kevin, <gasps> did Kevin the lemonade Gates. shit. Six nine, the six nine. Yo, that was the funniest shit when six nine interview and like they didn't know who Lil Skies was and he was just like, oh. Like surprise and oh, shit. Oh shit! Yeah, I seen that. But I then that. they didn't know who Tay K was a couple months later too. Right. That's even more that's, fucked up. Yo, no bullshit I feel though. Like that line no bullshit. Yeah. No, that's crazy, that's bro. Crazy. And that's why I don't fuck with interviews. Yeah. I don't fuck with that bullshit, bro. Don't like, don't bullshit me. That shit make me tight. That shit make me want to walk out. Like when you do some shit. How the fuck you don't know about Tay K? 
Right. Stop playing with me, bro. Like, My even, mom know about taking. Even if you <laughs> like, maybe you don't shit, listen bro. to that like, kind of music. That's not no dance. Like that's just crazy to me. Like, come on, niggas, no take yeah. bro. Maybe you don't come listen on. to the music, so you don't that's know about crazy. Lil Skies, but that's you didn't crazy. hear about the kid who has like a gigantic song and is facing like multiple murder. Like, you're right. not really paying attention to rap if you didn't hear about that. Yeah, real yeah, shit. And they're doing Facts. interviews like. Facts. They should know. Facts. That's crazy. <laughs> hey, can we hear about the double XL situation from your perspective? I mean, like, nah. Fuck it's <laughs> on Suey, man. Fuck it's on Suey, man. Up and coming no, freshman. No negativity, man. Yeah. Positive, positive vibes sent their way, man. Real okay, shit. Okay, but no negativity. Simple question. When you saw the cover, were you kind of like, damn, I could have been on that? Nah, I wasn't. Nah. Like, I wasn't. I wasn't. It wasn't something that was going to. I'm going to put it this way. It wasn't something that was going to affect my career. Like, I, if I would lose it, win. Like, Facts. I'm going to still win, bro. But still, you do kind of look at the photo and it's going viral and you're kind of like, damn, I would have looked kind of pretty on that. I don't care about that shit. <laughs> they could have had you I'm sit on smoke perp shoulders or something. I really do real shit. Like, I really make music I feel. I do everything like myself. Like, real, all this shit, bro. I have, like, I'm in everything that I do. You feel me? Like, I'm hands on with all this shit. So, like, I don't. I don't pay attention to that shit. And then I'm living a real life. Like, I'm in this shit now. I'm mm -hmm. around this shit. I don't need to, like, broadcast and do this and show all my shit. Nah. You feel me? You're going to hear it through the music. What the fuck I got to say? You're like Cardi B. Too big to do it. Right them fuck fucking, that. Right. I'm too big fuck for y'all. Right the camera. Yeah. Pump, pump, <laughs> pump fucked it up, though, because if Pump didn't... Nah, shout to Pump. Pump right. FaceTimed me right before the shit. Pump is that's definitely the homie, but that's Pump, pump could have very easily done the same thing that you nigga. and Cardi did and been I'm like, nah, fuck nigga. that shit. Shout out to Lil Pump, man. Let's get it. Switching game, nigga. Fuck y'all talking about. Let's go. Let's get it. You, you influenced by Lil Pump? Uh... He's a dope. Um, I'm influenced by everybody yeah, around me. Yeah, pretty much. I'm influenced by even Suey. No bullshit, you bro. You never know, bro. Like, no bullshit. You just listen no to bullshit. a bunch of shit. I definitely heard this shit before I started rapping. Maybe I was influenced by, you know, I'm influenced by a lot of shit. Mm. Well, but you could, maybe if you if you flex as hard as a little pump, you could be the youngest flexer. Because <laughs> you are much younger than him. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I don't people know decide. Oh. Man. Oh, man. So... What else, what else is important that we that we cover in this uh, interview? I'm trying to think. What's next? We talked about cloud goggles. That was pretty important. <laughs> we didn't pa we didn't pass the weed to you. That was Any important. Any projects? What's up? Yeah, yeah. How long you oh, been doing Lil Sky's the interviewer. Shit, you know what I mean? <laughs> this is like Jay <laughs> Cole interviewing Lil Pump. I was thinking of some shit. Like, right, right. I fuck with that interview. That was cool though. That was that was, that was so hard. That was dope for the culture, bro. That was big. Right. Yeah. Uh, what was what was the question? You Adam? focusing on a project? <laughs> no, Scott. like any projects. Nah, do you have yeah, Did he, um, Does he have any? Did you ever do any? Yeah. Well, I, I dropped one like early on, but I'm working on another one. Right. Fire ass project. Like, this is like way more developed than my last one. Uh huh. Yeah. It is going to be fire. I don't know when it's going to drop, but it's dropping. Have you yeah. thought about features? Do you have any idea who might be on it? Um, not sure because. I got I got some, but I don't know if they're going on the album. Right. Yeah. So I don't know. Yeah. Okay. You know what's funny is that video that we just put out with you that got like a million views. That like all the yeah, that's comments. That's my brother in that shit too, by the way. Yeah. Literally. Yeah. That's, that's Lil Sky's that's brother. That's Lil Sky's real brother. Really? Ten months apart. What's his name again? HBK. Shout HBK. HBK. Heartbreak Kid. Shout out to my brother. Real shit. Go that's fuck crazy. with him. Real shit. He fire. That song blew the fuck up. I already got a million views. What a up, million. Chris Long? Yeah, bro. Piece of Nobody shit. knows that, bro. That's important. <laughs> I had no idea. It's lit. That's bananas. I I, bro, I told day. you, bro. That's far. I've seen everybody in the comments just hating on those girls, being like, get off of Suey. He's too young for you. Fuck that, <laughs> nigga. My nigga Suey, the young playboy. Those girls are criminals. They need to be about. taken off the street. <laughs> <laughs> it's all Adam on there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I got thousands of fake accounts, and I'm just commenting, like, stay away from them. Sick fucks. <laughs> <laughs> oh man um so you you kind of have an interesting like braid situation going you got the half red half black what what led you in that direction yeah uh, I, skies no i'm playing <laughs> oh, man, no, man, no, man. <laughs> yeah um braids are lit bro i tried dreading up it didn't work mm -hmm. so i just took it out put some fucking braids in but I started off with braids, and then I was like, yo, it would be lit if I had dreads, because I hate sitting there while they pull my fucking hair for an hour. Mm. That shit. It's, now I'm used to it, so it don't matter, but yeah. And then, like, 
I just need to have some movement like that when you're jumping around on stage and shit. It looks lit. You gotta have something to shake. That's a fact. Yeah, and the color, even more lit. You're not in a gang. Nah. No Gucci gangs. gang. No gang. No. <laughs> No oh, that's good. Yeah, no gangs. Family shit. I kind of can't believe I'm still wearing these cloud goggles. Yeah, I can't see your eyes. Nah, yeah. that's fire. Is it bro. weird? You can't nah, see my Nah, that's fire. Leave I can never know where you're this looking. This is real shit. This is legendary, bro. Like, I agree. This is a fire. Is what the fuck has been going on with you guys? I know you guys got like infinity good stories about crazy shit that's happened to you guys on the road and shit. Y'all got some crazy shit. I mean, Sui been signing boobs and shit. <laughs> Shout out to my young nigga. Hey, that's regular. I'm very proud of that. Sign it and then just get a little bit of milk out of it I and then go right back to sign man. another one. I ain't no bad influence. That's just like good. I love to see the young people winning. I love yeah. to see everybody winning, bro. It's good to see people happy, like genuinely happy, like smiling, bro. But well, you know he's what it happy is. happy when he signed that boob. Yeah, he's 14, but he ain't, he, he's not like a regular 14 year old. You know, right, you nah. can't you can't judge him by the same yeah, rules. Right. Yeah, what's it called? Something crazy that happened was me and him were in the back of the tour bus just chilling, right? And then, like, we're like, yo, what would happen if we opened the window? Because there's, like, obviously, like, awesome. a bunch of people swarming the shit. And we're just like, let's open it. And then, like, he just, like, he did not even think about it. Like, as soon as he heard the idea, just push the button, open the fucking window. Next thing you know, there's people throwing their phones, throwing shit. And then, like, one person started, like, a trend where they would, like, hold each other up to, like, hold on to the fucking, like, the window, and they would, like, elevate themselves to the top and, like, ask for shit. We're just like, yo. What crazy. the hell is wrong with these kids? Yeah, it's we like a phone saying, though, It was like a was... swarm, like, literally. It was, like, hella hands just through the window. Like, people was wilding. People be bugging, bro. Our fans be lit, man. Shout out to our fans. Yeah. Genuinely, just all of our fans, because they literally fuck with all of us. They're like, like to the point where they try to love. climb in the window of the bro, bus. Bro, we all get that love, bro. No <laughs> bullshit. Like, my camera guy, my DJ, everybody, we getting that yeah. love, bro. Yeah. Fuck that Asia. We getting that love. Everybody on the <laughs> tour, bro. Everybody on the tour is like family for real. Oh, shit. Landon, you ever have anything scary happen with fans? Anything crazy? I had a lot of awkward situations. Yeah. I know we uh, probably had a lot together. Shit, just be awkward. I just like people trying to get, like, get my num number for like, Try to give me beats or like yeah, trying to stop collab doing and shit. that shit. And they're just like, stop I'll just it. like, I'll just like be stuck <laughs> outside and I'll be like, where the, where the fuck is everybody? Like trying to find a manager or some yeah. shit like, to get the fuck out of the situation. That's oh like no, the, the one new weird shit that was happening, it don't happen no more, but like. It would just be weird. They wouldn't even know Landon. Me and Landon would go like walk to go on stage, and they wouldn't even let Landon on stage. Like, oh, fuck. like Landon's not bro, an artist. They wouldn't let me. In I'm like, yo, that bro. ass, bro. Yeah, Security got to do a better job be like, with yeah. that shit. Stop They're doing like, that shit, bro. That they ass, y'all get me tight. I stop, like, I seen them stop him once, and like he's like, bro, I'm performing. Like, <laughs> yeah, I will snap on them niggas, bro. I hate he, that he shit. He goes crazy on the security. Oh my they God. always will try to do that. And when you're dealing with like. You know, maybe like Landon will be cool about it, but like when you're dealing with like super hood ass rappers, that's how the security it's gets beat gets up. Beat up, yeah. <laughs> nah, that shit happened in one of my shows. I think some nigga got some security got beat up. He fucked with the wrong. <laughs> he fucked with the wrong one. That's what we were about. Got trash. Yeah, one of the shows? yeah, he got oh, trash. Yeah, I remember that. That shit was You feel me? Crazy. But smack a security guard for 2018, man. No, nah, we love security. They just gotta, <laughs> they just gotta know yeah. what the fuck, who the fuck they protect, and it's like, they, what's up? They you protect, feel me? You know? but like, like sometimes they don't know. Who they don't, right, and mm -hmm. it's like nigga, like, feel me, damn. Do you have scary situations with girls? Anything come to mind in terms of those, you know, thirsty shit, extra shit? A lot. You go first. Go first. <laughs> go first. I mean, bro, they just be saying some weird shit sometimes. Like, like they just be screaming some weird shit. Like, <laughs> like bitches are screaming like, swallow my kids. No, like I'll swallow your kids or something. Like that. I was like, wow, shit. What? Young yeah, nigga and too. I, and then like you look them. And You're like, I am a kid. <laughs> <laughs> and the cry stop the show. Don't <laughs> eat me, man. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, but like they be saying that and like it's like they don't expect you to hear it, but then I heard it and I just like look down like I'm like look at them and I like look them in their eyes and they're like, oh shit, he knows. <laughs> yeah. God, what is wrong with these women? What's yours? My What's yours? shit be like, shit, I'll be having moms and daughters and like shit come up to me. And it just be weird sometimes how they be acting like. Like, the, I remember the one shit, the mom was like, hey, um, she was like, hey, this is my daughter. I was like, hey, what's up? She's like, hey. I'm like, yeah, I'm her mom. She's like, yeah. She's like, yeah, yeah we're going to have some fun tonight. And she's like, give me yeah. this look. Like, I'm like, oh. Were they shit. hot? 
Nah, <laughs> <laughs> it's like nah, nah. The, the daughter was bad, but you know the mom. She was. Nah. See, if the daughter was bad, See, I think like, I'd be willing to accept whatever the right, mom looked right. like. You know, I thought that too. You feel me? But just the idea of bringing a mother no and daughter shit. together like that. Yeah, it was just like for me, it'd be weird because it'd be awkward. Like I don't in this situation, it'd just be like you know, <laughs> you know what do you do? Like what do you say? Like. Yeah, but you feel me, like, if they're do- trying to do it with you, they were probably trying to do this like before too. Like they probably did this with like OG Mako a couple years knows? ago. You know, that's what I'm saying, bro. Yeah. So I'd be like, I'm one of them dudes. Like I'm mad low key, bro. I don't even be like, you feel me? I still <laughs> like, I don't. Not Skies said. is so low key that he Skies won't fuck a mother daughter combo. I won't, man. Pussy. I'm respectful, Pussy. man. Nah. I would definitely take the mom though. I ain't gonna flex. You thought the mom was a better idea than the daughter? No, I mean just like in general, like oh, really? I always like, oh, yeah, really, I always older women. That's interesting. Yeah. All right, back to Sue. <laughs> <laughs> you got any like famous women in the industry? Like you know, Comethazine's got Demi Lovato. You got like a, a person that you're like fixated oh, on. Uh, I just want to fuck Demi. <laughs> I, I love, love bro. That that's sounds so hard. Crazy, I love bro. Comethazine, bro. He told me that Demi Lovato knows that he's trying to fuck and that like he's like talked to people who have talked to her about his song about her and shit. Oh shit. Ew, I want to see what he would that's do. That's fire. Like Shout out to bro. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> me, I love Comethazine. Oh uh, right. fuck. Let me think. I'm trying to fuck all the famous bitches, bro. Mm. I had some lit ones, but I don't even <laughs> broadcast them, you know? Cause it's just like if it happens, it happens. Yeah, and it's just like you know, I'd rather, you know, I'm, I'm respectful to the ladies. Anything. You know, yeah. I'm respectful. I just right. be low key until they want to. Michelle Obama's taken, so it's like whatever. Like, what else is there? Yeah. Right. Right. There's nothing left <laughs> right. in this world. For real. That's a fact. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, wait. This is such a crucial question. I forgot to ask: Is where did your name come from? Everybody wants to know that. Yeah, I don't even know that Yo, shit. I know so what it like, means now. Up. So like, um, I was thinking, where what should I get my name, right? Because I was like, yo, I'm about to be a rapper. I'm about to just, <laughs> I'm about to, I gotta think of a name, right? I'm just sitting in my under my bunk bed, like, yo, uh, yo, what if in I'm your like, bunk bed? Yeah, you bro. had bunk beds. Yeah, you know what it is. Bro. Oh, you come from the struggle. All right. <laughs> I have bunk beds. I still got a blow up mattress. I had a bunk bed at one point. Yeah. <laughs> uh, you still do? Gay, right? Do yeah, you really? Bro, shit. Bro, 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 nigga, shit, man. That's fire. Yeah, I respect that. Man, Blow up mattress man. sucks. Yeah, All so right. I was just chilling under, you know, just chilling. And then I was thinking, like, yo, I'm about to be a rapper. Like, I gotta think of a rap name. So I'm like, um, yeah, I need to think of some catchy shit. Should I put a little in front of it or should I not? And I was like, yo, I'm not gonna do that actually. And then I was, I was like, yo, I want a, like a unique name. And I was like. A unique name, yeah, unique. And I just looked up like fucking unique, different words for unique. Too generous with. I was like, bro, that's perfect. Like how, like that's so unique to have like a unique word inside of the definition of unique. You know? Yeah. So it's literally just unique. That's hard. It is unique. One of a kind. Of skies was just looking at the sky. He was like, Yeah, I'm gonna be skies. Hell yeah. <laughs> <laughs> is like, that yeah, it? That's what it is. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know if I ever right. asked you where your name came from, but I'm just going to assume that was it. You were like, man, I fuck with that that everything up there. Everything. All that shit. And Landon, Landon was like... Landon's like, uh, what does it say on my... Uh, what does it say on my ID? I'm Landon Q. <laughs> Landon Q. Landon he was looking at a glass of water, and he's like, I love ice cubes. <laughs> bro, my da- bro, my shit, well, my dad's name was like Dark Skies. When oh. he was like, yeah, he said he was like the first black person of his class to graduate or some shit. I don't know. Whoa. So funny shit. Yeah. That's a cool and, story. And where I went to school at, it was like super like. White. Not hella racist. Yeah. You feel me? So yeah. So like, yeah. So his name was Dark Skies. My dad was like a ladies man. So the girls would see me and always call me Lil Skies. They, that ass would always be like, oh, that's Lil Skies. Hey, Lil Skies. So I just started. I literally started running with it. Like that's nobody. Right. I that's just, a good so story. Just, yeah, that's a good. Literally, you talk about the skies and shit, but like you got a good story. <laughs> All right. I guess it's kind of cool. Yeah. No, that is that's a pretty fine. good story. Yeah. Yeah, that is. Now your shit lit. Oh, I really fuck with that. That's hard. No, Bro, that's I good. literally just like put my head to it. Like, yo, I want to be like unique. So I just chose unique. Right. right. You ever talked to Matt Ox? Yeah. He's I feel like uncle, bro. you yeah, and him he, should do a song together. I brought him out on my tour too. I don't know yeah. if Suey's at that show. Oh, yeah. But I brought Matt Yeah, out. I was there in Philly. Oh, yeah, the Philly show. We, I brought him out for the Philly his show. His song, and then I came yeah. out with you. 
Bro, that's that hard. shit was lit, bro. Yeah, Mad bro. Ours came out. Oh, He's on me, bro, for real. Fuck it, bro, hard. I was bummed when oh, I saw. Yes, God. yo. Oh. Anybody who was like, oh, Maddox fell off, they should have been like, no. nah, 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 nah. As soon as I heard playing. that, nah. Shut up. No, nah, I was bummed when I saw that Maddox got his chain took, but he didn't really. He, he was oh, he was no. trolling. Yeah, I seen that on like Sport page. I'm like, yo, what is it? It's like that's Maddox's chain. And then I seen that, I was like, oh, bro, just in general, me. just in general, do not listen to anything the internet says. If you don't hear it from that person, no bullshit. Right. It's in general. Don't do it. Yeah. It's gonna misguide you. And ain't nobody taking Suey's chain. Nah. No. Fuck no. He'll kill you. Definitely pop a, not pop with a me. hole in you real quick. Oh. Definitely not with me. His dad's He's got a shirt that says shit. scary AF. <laughs> scary as fuck. Yo. Which, if you try to take yo, his chain, playing, I think his dad yo. would snap into scary right AF mode. Bro, I got a homie too. I got the homies right here too, bro. So. And you got little scars to beat them motherfuckers. Man, we ain't, Land, bro, bro, bro. It's Land a cute headlock. Bro, we ain't got them type of fans where we gotta even be worried about that shit. Our fans come to shows to have fun. Them niggas don't be like, they come to show to literally. That's why we're gonna always be like, live forever. I saw I told my niggas, like, literally, we are forever because, like, we got the type of fans just gonna come to have fun they're not coming to look good dress nice and all that shit no them niggas wanna have fun be sweaty do fuck Molly. that black and blue eye all that that's what we gonna give them hell yeah straight up that's what's up that's beautiful yeah that shit is lit yeah, you're yeah. lucky cause a lot of people they got the kind of fans that are like trying to show off their no, gun no, at like, the show and of, shit yeah, a lot of people be like <laughs> flexing like that what though. the fuck like a lot of people be flexing like that like like making people wanna like take shit like mm. In ways like saying they're gangster and shit, but like I'm out here not saying shit. Like I'm right. Just, like I'm not saying I'm hard. I'm not saying I'm gangster. I'm not saying none of that shit. If you notice, we won't be speaking about now. none of this shit that we right. ever be doing. Like just literally, you fun, don't ever man. see. Like we just. Real. I've been to shows where like people came and like showed us their guns. I was like, yo, look, I got my gun in. I'm like, wow, that's really scary. Like, I <laughs> right. wish we weren't in this venue right now. <laughs> right. It's like, oh, shit. <laughs> nah. I'm like, god damn, what the fuck is the security man, doing here, man? Hey, don't ever bring that shit to our show, man. You don't <laughs> need that. You don't need that. It's straight love. No, yeah, no. bro. Love. No. I see you got your shooter back there, huh? Oh, of course. Cut. At all times. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. A couple of them, you know? All right, so what do we need to know before we wrap this up in terms of what's, what Sui's about to do? I feel like this interview is going to actually really, like, help take the shit oh, to another yeah. level. Like, oh, yeah. People need to know. All right, this is a big one. Uh-oh. We got the Now music video coming soon, little bitch. Right, you shot last night, right? Yeah, we're going to shoot. Little no, bitch. We're going to shoot after this, too. Oh, really? We're yeah. always shooting. Oh, we should, bro. Yeah. No, damn. I want to come through tonight once if because I think I got to do the Cup Boys interview Whatever next. Whatever you want to do, yeah, Ooh, bro. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I'll pull no, up for here. sure. We I was gonna do it last night, out. but I was Are they coming done. Here? Oh yeah, we here. He's coming back to another. We post it. Cup, Bo- Cup Boys coming to do his own, I think. Oh, oh yeah, yeah that's that's I think. I don't know. Yeah, we might do it another day. Who knows? Right. Wait, tell you? Wow. I love that know. about you wow. guys. So I, now it's smoke. Now you know what? Now it's smoke. Oh, yeah. we, 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 smoke. Smoke. we were with them last night. He ain't saying nothing. Smoke, right? We were with we them last night. We were with them last night. We were all crazy. smoke with Cam, bro. Fuck That's Cam. Crazy. Okay, good point. We were with no. smoking right. weed at his interview. That's right. what it was. Oh. He's embarrassed. He got wicked high. Remember that? That's why I replaced him with you. You can handle yourself, yo. Okay, Cam. Now I'm gonna smoke it up. We no, but you know, know you know, like you guys totally could have been like, oh, like this this vlogger dude, like kind of helped to put us on in the beginning, but like fuck that, we don't fuck with you anymore. No, he's like on tour with you guys. You guys kept that. And that's he actually all like that. that's actually my best friend. Like before the f- everything, like yeah. we started like the whole Cuff Boys channel and shit. And like, that's my best like, friend like, too. Because that's really, <laughs> that's been a huge like that has helped blow him up a lot. Like people oh, just yeah. seeing him on tour with you guys and being able to create so much content on the road. Bro, and it's shit. like weird, but like we all help each other that's what it is bro, now we just all help our, each like, other our like group is so nice bro. all together that's like, weird like how it's Sui's gen it's Sui's interview but like it's all of us still right. yeah like you feel me like, like even if it's mine of you can still be here and talk about the same shit yeah like we just came to just like talk bro so people can see how we are for real we like, just came to show off our grills yeah for real that's what they right? <laughs> Lennon's out here representing for like proper dental care the clean good hair oh dude I got a dentist hey, appointment hey, tomorrow stop work. fucking playing with my man yeah, bro. Give him that deal. When's the last time you guys went to the dentist? I gotta go tomorrow. I'm happy. Uh, I just went. <laughs> <laughs> I love getting my teeth clean, though. It feels so good. Nah, it does. It does. Bro, it feels so good after. Me, I just go, Especially right now, because my teeth feel dirty as fuck. I feel like there's crap all over them in the back and shit. Tomorrow's gonna be beautiful. <laughs> 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 I gotta go yeah. prepare for my dentist appointment. Right. All right. Well, hey, I love all you guys. We love you too. Love you too. I'm about to go take a. F- I gotta piss so bad right now. Bro, 
I thought you were about to roll up some of this, man. Yeah, roll Shout that out up to for Bear sure. Woods, man. Hey, Chris Thank Long's you. gonna take the photo of you guys, and uh, I'm gonna go take a piss, and then I'm gonna come back and take another photo. We're gonna have the, the diamonds out and everything. Bad, let's God. Do it. Yeah. Yeah. All right, Sui Generous, Landon Cube, Little Skies, another banger. He's if you enjoyed this, so generous up next get on next. Instagram and follow everybody involved. The names are on the yeah. screen. Just get that shit. Shout out No Jumper. No Jumper. Get Shout out to you guys. Much love. Much hey, love. No Jumper. Coolest podcast in the world. Check us out on YouTube, SoundCloud, iTunes. Yeah. Bang!